ready to lay the smack down. The following contest is a triple threat extreme rules match. Making his way to the ring from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE Champion, The Rock! Well, here's a man who's captured the imagination of the entire sports entertainment industry, the Brahma Bull, one of the very best of all time. Without question, The Rock has been a champion at every level and a surefire future WWE Hall of Famer. is here! And his opponents, first, from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds. The WWE Champion, Brock Lesnar! Emotionless, heartless, and hell-bent on absolute destruction. That, my friends, is the Beast Incarnate, Brock Lesnar. No emotion, no remorse, just simply poised for absolute destruction. That is the beast incarnate Brock Lesnar to a T. The toughest SOB in WWE history. I got a premonition we're about to see some mud holes stomped and walk dry before our very eyes. Come on, let's go! And from Victoria, Texas, weighing in at 252 pounds, Stone Cold Steve Austin! Don't worry, gentlemen, I saw a cooler full of Steve Weisers over there by the ham. I'm gonna make sure they're well guarded. Hey, if you see a kombucha, grab one for me. A what? A kombucha. sure to be a chaotic extreme rules match you're gonna see the rock rock lesnar and a steve austin many extreme rules matches in history 
but I don't believe I've ever seen a true blueprint for success in this contest. Draw up your blueprints and throw them away, Saxton, because they'll do you no good. The amount of variables in play in this match make it extremely unpredictable. Wicked clothesline! How does one best take advantage of the extreme rules environment? Quite simply, if you can dream it, you can do it. This isn't the time to be timid. This is the time to leave it all in the ring. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. He's been placed in the corner now. And like a pie, and a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. Oh, and a right hand for good measure. He's lost some of his win now. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Powerless position to be in right now. Lands face first. Well scouted by the great one. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Up high. He is revving up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Dropped on the crown. Oh, look at this. A release belly to belly. More damage to the leg. Bang right in the face. Drop kicked all the way to the floor. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. Lesnar cuts him off. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer underneath the ring. Boom, caught him in the head. He's heading back to the ring. And he's a step ahead of Austin. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. Fishing for something beneath the ring. It's like I always say, he who has the sledgehammer has the last lap. Extreme rules match for sure, but not sure how much more tenable it could be. Nice 
goodness! Uh oh, he's searching for something. Oh, great. Now for something painful and tall.
Lesnar's in the leg. Lesnar wards him off. Here's the pump handle. Suplex launched. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Storming impact. Got it. That left can cause some serious damage. Some dangerous attacks on the ball, but now the damage is exponentially multiplying. This is just getting uncomfortable. Familiar situation for Austin. And it's the Rock with the reversal. Oh, it's a rather crude facial reconstruction. That's not very nice. That's not right. is pouring more fuel on this fire right now. for something beneath the ring. Heads out, and he has all the time he wants. Taking it outside the ring now. Three books.